Assalamu alaikum brothers from Grozny. All right, it's lunchtime. I'm a little bit hungry. And so I've come to this street where there's a few little cafes. I want to go and try some, some Kavkaz food. Let's go and find a place. There's a little place up here. I don't know, I've never been here before. I don't know what it's like, what they serve, but um, let's go and check it out and try some food. Should be fun, should be tasty. Wow. Rosie, all this fresh stuff, pasta. Where is the soup? It's Lakman. Lakman or Yalublu Lakman? Well, let's um, go and find a place to sit down and then we'll try some food. It's going to be good. No, I want to try some Chechen and try it. So I think Lachman would be good. And what else can I do? What can I do? Gulyash, how much? Let's go Gulyash. 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 Yes, there's no meat here. Okay, let's go. Thank you. I want to show you something, which is that here in Chechnya, the restaurants have a separate little room for where you eat. So you come in here and then you close your curtain and then you have your private little room to entertain. Um, obviously, Chechnya, although a very safe place, is also a conservative place. Okay, the meal came quicker than I thought. Oh, it's hot. Let's have a look. So this is Lachman. And this is what they eat a lot down in the Caucasus. And it's basically meat, vegetables and pasta underneath there. Um, all mixed in together. And um, almost every time I've had it, almost every time I've had it, it's been delicious. So let's try the Lachman. Let's give it a go. Let me show you what this is like here, look. So it's basically a spaghetti with meat, minced meat, and with carrots and with potato, um, and then some dill sprinkled on top. Um, yeah, it's really good. It's really filling. Um, and I imagine it's going to be very cheap. Um, I don't know the price, but things like this in the Caucasus normally cost about, I don't know, maybe you would pay 150 rubles, which is what, it's like one pound 50. So uh, yeah, let's tuck in. Let's chat. This is my second course, it's goulash in a bed of mashed potato. Kind of thing that we would uh, eat at school as kids. Let's tuck in and see what it's like. Not very traditional, let's face it, but okay, let's do it. Mm, creamy potato. It's good, it's good. The meat is, um, I think the meat is lamb. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's really good. I can eat another portion of this easily. Well, that was genuinely very delicious. Now, my only disappointment so far here is the tea. I was kind of expecting some Chechen type of tea, I don't know, some green tea or something. But all they brought me is a cup of boiling water and a tea bag, English edition black tea, and a slice of lemon. As a little surprise, the lady brought out a bowl of summer fruits here and a bowl of sweets and set on the house. So I don't know if that's just special for me or if they do that for everyone who comes to this restaurant. But let's try it. Mm. Well, that was a good meal. Enjoyed that. Ate everything up. Just the tea was a little bit disappointing, but apart from that, everything was good. So um, let's get out of my little curtained cubicle that I've had all to myself and um, let's go pay the bill. Сто девяносто рублей. Сто девяносто. Да, хорошо. Сто. Двести. Девяносто. Не надо. Спасибо вам большое, это очень вкусно. Честно. Вам тоже спасибо. Давайте.
So um, that was the Chechen Cafe. That was pretty interesting. So the bill came to 290 rubles, which is about three pound fifty. So what's that? Four dollars US. Um, tasty. Very interesting that they had the separate curtain little rooms there. So I suppose men can't flirt with your woman or look at your sister. I'm not sure. Um, but friendly people. Chechens are wonderful people. Um, yeah, I'm full. So I'm now going to go and explore the centre of the city. Let's go and do it.